Which fight that you <laughs> thought was better, like the fight that Goku had with Seventeen and Super or GT? Which one did you enjoy more overall? Like the fight with from GT from you know, beginning GT, to end. Goku fought Super Seventeen. Yeah, and then a Super Goku fought Seventeen also. So Honestly, like I. <sighs> Because in the GT1, I remember in some, like, 17, I remember 17 demolishing Goku, yo. In GT? Yes, like, Super 17, like, at least when Goku, like, I just remember him just demolishing him. Like, Goku, like, like, 18 oh. played a crucial role in beating him. Like, I just remember him just getting demolished, yo. I'll recap it a bit. So, it was mm -hmm. like, <clears throat> in the beginning, 17 was, like, more relative to Super Saiyan Goku. Like, mm -hmm. Or Super Saiyan 2, like, give or take, whatever. But mm -hmm. Goku had the edge with it. The problem was Goku just kept feeding 17 energy. And it's like he went in Super Saiyan 4 to close the gap a bit after giving him energy in the Super Saiyan mm -hmm. 1. And mm -hmm. Goku was doing his thing. Like, you, you know, you were dominating 17 until you start giving him his energy. Then 17 started to get crazy on him. And it's like, how long did he refuse? Bro, he did the dumb Goku thing, bro. It's like he okay, knew he cause... absorbed it and still did the times 10 command man. Like, okay, okay, nonsense, okay. Bro. That's literally where the memory is like clear. Like I just remember him sh constantly feeding him like key attacks. I'm just thinking like, yo, what is going on? Like, like 17 is just getting strong. jacked and beating the shit out of him at this point. But initially Goku was stronger than him. Okay, okay. That that makes sense to me and that's cool. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Later, later, but hey, look. And, you know what's so. up. That fight left a bad taste in my mouth, and the super one, you know what? I'm going to be honest. It's like, I will stick for the GT one, then the super one, because that 17 just getting stronger out of nowhere, matching blue. Like, I lost my mind. Yeah, I, I ain't like that, bro. I lost my mind. But the super 17 one, it makes sense. Like, you know, you fuse, and then that's your whole mechanic. Like, you were, like, Goku, first off, you literally did the dumb thing you, you did against Angel at 19. Like, what the hell? But anyways, like, like you, you did, like... <clears throat> He charged up. Like, you were pissing me off, but, like, your strength made sense. It's like, yeah, because you were getting energy from, like, Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Like, that was bound to Time make you strong and stuff like that. Times 10. Stop hating him on Boy 17. Look, 17 is cool. Like, he... That's his favorite character. Yeah, like... <laughs> nah, like, it really is, though. That's actually Crimson's favorite. Say, and my Boy 17. But, like, we're not just going to act like, like he's not doing bullshit. Like, he's that guy. It's MVP 17 always. But like, come on. As a where were you? Man, you where were you in Battle of Gods? Where were you when our dogs needed help? He was there for hiding. Boo. I ain't gonna say no. He was there for the bull. He was there for Boo. He was. He was. But it's like, look. First off, do you even consider Super Seventeen? I'm talking to you, Crimson. Like a true Seventeen, because energy <laughs> absorbing and all that's not even his thing. And he was acting like a. I mean, he yeah, he had little quotes here and there, but it's just like. <laughs> He, Super 17 is like future 17 vibes because he was like literally a cynical demon. But it's like in Z, 17 was never like that. 17 wasn't an evil demon and all that. And I know they were doing some mind control Lee, but it just seemed like a version of 17 that doesn't even exist really. And it was just kind of like, you know, like, I don't know. How you it was literally a, it was literally future 17, like. Because at the end of the because 17 was doing some weird thing over there. Like, there was regular 17 who lived his life. He wasn't really talking to his sibling like that. And there was the Hellfighter 17. It's like Hellfighter 17 was basically the equivalent of what Future 17 was in Trunks' timeline. And that just became the dom dominant personality. You love the energy absorber. Ah, I, I guess so. Huh? I guess. And the game, it was cool. Because, like, cause you know when you could deflect key attacks and stuff like that? Like, instead yeah. of deflecting it, you absorb it and stuff. That was cool. Mm -hmm. 